Damon's back. There was no way he's not here for her. Is it crazy to want back what we lost? I don't know why I feel so nervous. Everyone's wondering what you took and if the rest of us did too. Don't we deserve to know the truth? I don't know if y'all can come back from this. All American Homecoming series. All right, y'all, let's break down what just went down in this last episode and what's about to hit us in the finale. Things are getting real. And trust me, we're in for some major drama and emotional moments. So you know how Simone's been rehearsing to confess her feelings to Lando, right? She's been all nervous, practicing with Keisha, and we're just waiting for her to finally lay it all on the table. But here's the thing. This finale is about to throw some serious curveballs, especially with Damon coming back into the mix. Now, let me tell you, Damon returning is going to shake things up big time. As we know, Damon is Simone's ex, and they've got history. And you can't just ignore history. You know what I'm saying? He's coming back to give some advice to JR, but you know there's no way he's stepping back into town without some unresolved feelings for Simone. I'm going to tell you right now, it's about to get messy. We've been watching Simone and Lando grow closer and closer, and just when she's ready to finally tell Lando how she feels, boom, Damon shows up. It's like the universe is testing her, and we're all here for it. Now, in this next episode, Simone's going to open up to Amara when her integrity is questioned. We're not exactly sure what's going to go down, but it sounds like Simone's going through something heavy. And with everything happening between her, Lando, and now Damon's return, she's going to need someone to talk to. Amara's always been that wise figure for Simone, so I expect this conversation to be deep. Like, we might finally get to see what's going on in Simone's head, about these two guys. But let's get back to the love triangle, because honestly, that's what we're all here for, right? So here's my prediction. Simone's feelings for Lando are real. We've seen her struggle to figure out if it's just gratitude or if she truly loves him. And she's realized it's so much more than just gratitude. But now that Damon's back, will old feelings start to surface? I mean, they were together for a reason, and feelings like that don't just disappear. So the big question for the finale is, will Simone turn down Damon and fully commit to Lando? Or is she going to be torn between these two? And as for Lando, he's going to be skeptical about his future possibilities. We saw in the last episode how he's still hiding behind the just friends thing. But deep down, we know he's feeling Simone too. But now with Damon back, he might start doubting where he stands with her. This dude's got to figure out what he wants and fast. Because if he hesitates, Damon might swoop in and take his chance with Simone. I'm telling you, it ain't looking too good for Lando if he keeps playing it safe. Then we've got Marcus trying to do everything he can for Noah, but there's some resistance there. Not sure what that's all about yet, but Marcus is another character who's been trying to make things right. It'll be interesting to see how that plays out, but the main focus for us is definitely going to be on this love triangle. Now, let's talk predictions. I think we're finally going to get that moment we've all been waiting for, Simone confessing her feelings to Lando. But, and this is a big but, Damon's going to make things complicated. He's going to have something to say, maybe even try to win her back. And I'm telling you, Simone's going to be torn. Like, do you go with the guy who's been there for you through thick and thin, Lando? Or do you give it another shot with your first love, Damon? It's one of those classic TV show dilemmas. And honestly, I'm not sure which way it's going to go. My gut feeling? Simone's going to stick with Lando, but not without some serious hesitation. I think her feelings for Damon are going to flare up, but she'll realize Lando's the one who's been there when it really mattered. Plus, she's done all this soul-searching, and I feel like she's finally ready to choose what's best for her, not just what's comfortable or familiar. So, what do you guys think? Is Simone going to stick with Lando, or is she about to get pulled back into Damon's world? And how do you think Lando's going to react if he finds out about Damon's return? It's all building up to this big moment and I'm dying to hear your thoughts. Drop a comment below and let me know who you're rooting for, Team Lando or Team Damon. And as always, don't forget to smash that like button if you're vibing with this recap. Subscribe if you haven't already. Seriously, what are you waiting for? And hit that notification bell so you don't miss the finale breakdown. It's about to get wild and you won't want to miss it. Catch you next time, fam.